Hello everybody, how's it going? This is Nemanon, and welcome back to part 54 of my Let's Play of Fire Emblem, The Sacred Stones. Now, as we left off, we began the Siege of Rustin, and we got some pretty cool stuff going on here, not gonna lie. We're gonna send Dussel back into combat, because he is ready to take on the enemy, and uh, I guess I'll use the Devil's Axe and bash it right against their skull. Bam. I tried to do like a, a southern accent. I don't know if I did it well. I am. I live in the far north, so it's quite difficult. It's like polar opposites, man. It's like snow versus sun. All right. I don't think there's anything over here, so I guess I can keep the cell there. Just let him solo stuff and uh, let's, let's do some. Sli oh, you're gonna do zero damage. Zero damage. All right. Oh, you're gonna do 18 damage though. I don't like that one. Oh, you have no. Okay, never mind. All good. All good. Let's use the slim sword. Wait, how much? Six. Bam. Done. I forget what the worm slayer actually does, but I'm pretty sure it's not, it's irrelevant. So, oh, a brave lance. I like these weapons. I can strike consecutively. Nice. Um, I guess I'll just kill him. Goodbye, man. <laughs> it's just like. And then next turn, I can uh, give Ephraim that Brave Lance. And what it means, I think, what it means by striking consecutively is means I can always hit twice, which is neat. But my guys are pretty fast as it is, so I mean, I almost send him a turn. Yeah, there's that. Joshua's just doing some work all by himself, you know, he's mind his own business. You know, just taking on an entire army, no big deal. Alright, step back. Four times? Four times? Oh my god. This is the best weapon in the game. Oh my god, and they crit too. This is great. And I have so many of them. I'm so excited. I'm not gonna lie, I am extremely excited because I have Lance as well on Ephraim. Oh my god. Yeah, I, uh, I need more brave weapons. Does uh did I get any more? Brave bow, brave lance, brave sword. Yes. Now, that's what I'm talking about. I need to give that to somebody. Uh, I don't know who, though. I'm just use this. Oh, and a crit. Zippity zap. Can't go back. Boom. Good night, Remnant. I guess I'll send you south. I just... Did I kill them already? Kinda seems like it. Ah, uh, I got three weapons though, which is really sweet. Okay, we got some sword masters. And a crit to your face. Good night. God, those uh, these brave weapons, they are they are beautiful. I'm gonna have so much fun with those. What is this guy? Oh, it's just one of these guys, you know? Just a crit? Bam. No. Just, it's a charge up, you know? It just, it makes you think it's gonna be a big hit. But no, he just stands there and takes it. Man, Ephraim, you are getting so much experience here. Oh, uh, this guy reminds me of Ford. I'm kinda sad. Cause he died. He died a long time ago. Ram is gonna level the crap up. There's so many guys down there, oh my god. I'm pretty sure half their army is just, you know, garrisoned down there. Other phase. Is there still some left? I don't know. I frame kinda needs the heals. I kinda wanna give him the weapon, but I don't actually need it yet. Um, 
29? I'll take it. I'll see if uh, Erica can kill this guy. If not, I might just give him the weapon. Oh, there's a, quite a few down there. Uh, legendary weapon, anyone? Yeah. Yeah, please. Oh, and there's a critical. So, I'm probably making poor use of my legendary weapon. But... Oh, nice! 1 HP! That's so rad. Uh, I guess I'll send you this way. Doesn't look like there's anyone left. Um... Is that really all that's left? Well, I mean, I guess... I guess that's pretty cool, you know? I wonder if I can start to buy these brave items. Because for the final level, this will be really useful. Um, not gonna lie. Um, I guess I'll send you up too. Rakiel. Yeah, hopefully I don't get flanked. It doesn't look like they have anyone left. They're all at the entrance. Which means that's just reinforcements. I need to get Ephraim healed up. Oh, one health. This is a situation where that consecutive weapon would be really great. The only problem is that it still uses up one each attack. So it's like, sure I can attack four times. But I'm still using up four. Oh, uh, he's gonna start using his legendary weapon now. Oh my god, he hit me. I can't believe he hit. If he would've crit, I would've been really sad. He's like a 4% chance to crit, 60% chance to actually hit. So, oh yeah, there's Sigmund. Good night, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, Valiant Resistance, but... <laughs> yeah. Against Sigmund, yeah, she's not gonna do a whole lot. These Swordmasters are a right nasty piece of work, you know? I think she hit me too. It's just I'm so worried because like even though they do zero damage, even if it crits, it's still gonna do a lot. Yeah, I'm gonna have to have uh, Erica and uh, Ephraim kind of peel out a little bit. They are taking a little bit of damage, not too much, but I'm not too confident that uh, I'll be able to continue taking on the waves. Because I don't think this is gonna end until the actual level ends. So I kind of use this as a chance to level up, but I don't really think that's an issue. Of course, he's got a ranged weapon. I do love the color combo though. That bow totally matches everything. Good job, guys. God, there's so many. Sorry if you heard me crack my knuckle. Alrighty, so there is a lot here. I am actually gonna peel the crap out. Um, I used to just sell. Fly that way, little birdie. Kill you. Wow, you have a lot of weapons. Should I use a legendary? Nah. <laughs> I think Amelia can do well um, standing against these guys, so I'll keep her in the front. I'll make her my vanguard. And, uh, I might keep someone else. I think I'm gonna keep him to sell. Uh, I'll just back off a little bit. Um, there we go. Got a nice little setup here. Actually, Garrick, take your sword. Yeah, and you just kind of want you down here too. I think I, I think I oh, there are some back there. Okay. I think I have a pretty good position though. I can protect myself from both the flank and the front too. So, although I do need to get some tougher units back there. Um, because right now I only have my ranged. I don't really think they'd have reinforcements there. 
now that they can actually attack me, um, like most of them can attack me, I might actually just take this time to have a counter strike. You know, now that they've pushed in, I can just slaughter them all quite easily, probably. So I think I'll just do that. Because these guys currently are just walking into a slaughter. Unfortunately, I didn't have my bow equipped in. But, uh, a mage should be one shotted. They have quite a few mages, don't they? 0% chance of crit, though. I enjoy seeing that one. Meh. One health. Yeah, I love seeing that one too. Yeah, I like seeing the level though. That's pretty nice. But I, I feel like I'm leveling incorrectly. Just because each time I level, none of my guys actually gain anything useful. Something just happens. See, so yeah, I have a good position here. I can just attack them. Um, where's my healer at? Oh, do you have like a vulnerary or something? Not really. I want to give the sword probably to Joshua. I think that would be great, actually. Uh, trade. And I can send Joshua up here. Um, don't think he quite needs. Use the brave sword, he could probably kill them all, as is. Uh, do you have a Vulnery? No. Uh, you have an elixir, I'll send you up to it, just to help him out a little bit. I kind of want to keep Serene out of combat, but like, I guess I'll send her in. And, uh... Alright, now I can strike them down. I probably could have used Sela to kill that guy, but whatever. I'm kind of cautious about sending Sela in. For obvious reasons. Brave Bow. It's attacked four times. I want to see it strike four times. I can't wait to use that against a boss. That's going to be funny. Um, I could do that. Um, I think I'll send you in first. Oh. My gosh, okay. Awkward. Um, just a little bit. Um, I'll stay with Siegeling. I shouldn't have too much problem with Amelia. Um, I think she can tank it all quite comfortably, to be honest. That's why I kind of sent her in, because I had a feeling something like that would happen. Uh, I do have some guys up here that are vulnerable. Let me see something real quick. Yeah, uh, Sayla would be in huge trouble if I sent him in. I might actually lose one of these guys. I might lose any of these. Um, can I rescue him? Can't. It's unfortunate. Alright, um... Things might go a little sour here, to be honest. Let's see how it goes. Um, I think I'm putting too much faith in some of my guys. Ugh, now that I think about it, that weapon would have been pretty useful. I don't think he would have so much HP, to be honest. I keep saying that, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, see, like, the Steel Sword can take out these guys quite easily. I guess it's just the big guys I have to be annoyed with. I think Joshua can take these out just fine. I don't think I'll need my other guy. I might have to bring out the consecutive sword though. Which would be not ideal. Because I'd prefer to save it, but we'll see how many reinforcements we actually get up here. If this is really all I have to worry about, I don't think it'll be too much of a problem. We'll see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to bring out the sword. There's too many of these guys. Wow, that was literally just a paper cut. 12 damage. Um, if they can get one more guy, Sailor's dead. Yeah, Sailor's dead. <sighs> or not Sailor, and he's... Ah. <sighs> 
Alright. You know, it's 4.30 in the morning. I'm blaming that for, for Inez's death. But to be honest, this is a really tough level, actually. Because it's just a survival. You know, my position wasn't as good as I was hoping it would be, but... That's alright. Uh, Amelia is probably just going to take them all out by herself from this point on. I just... I had Inez out a little too far. Like, this sucks because him with that bow was going to be amazing. But I do have plenty of units still, so it's not like... I mean, I'm not, it's not like I'm going to lose because of that. Um, I think I'm perfectly fine still. Especially if, I actually, if they give me another one, another unit. But I don't think they will at this point. It seems pretty late. But I, I think I still have an extra... I don't have the Dragon Light Emira, but I don't know what exactly she can use as a weapon other than Dragonstone. So, and I don't know if I can actually buy Dragonstone. Yeah, uh, Erica's probably gonna have to get back to. Oh, she's dead. She might be dead here. I didn't expect uh, that. Um. God, this is actually tough. I'm just- I just have the worst positioning right now. Is that guy not gonna attack Erica? That would be amazing. Oh. Oh my. Erica's dead. She's done. I have to restart this thing. <sighs> Dang it. He's gonna attack, and he's not gonna miss. I'm pretty sure it's going to make me have to restart it. Come on. It's making me wait till the very end. Have I had a restart yet? I think I might have had it once. Um, let's see here. Oh, never mind. Alright. He's not doing any damage. That's pretty good. Very lucky of me. So I might be okay. Um, unless... This pilfered, huh? Okay. So, not all is lost yet. Uh, crap. I'm actually getting the episode here. Uh, <laughs> this is taking a long time. Sorry, I guess I gotta split this up a bit more. Anyways, thank you for watching, everybody. Uh, stay tuned for the next part when hopefully we don't have to restart the game. Um, let me see something. I could potentially just send her up. Does she have anything? No, hold on. I'm trying to see if anyone has like a thing. Alright, well, <laughs> see you guys. Uh, yeah, goodbye. <laughs>